Oh, I see, Phenom. I see, I see. Well, I assumed that you were going to test it with Maggie. Alright, guys. Let's go talk to Hanako. Night. Alright, come on, don't do this. Don't do this. Before we go in, I'm just gonna do a quick double check, see if I have anything else I can do. Uh I think that's it. Pretty sure that's it. I'm pretty sure we checked last time, but that was The ones that are still here are bugs, so yeah, whatever, let's go. Point of no return. You reach the point of no return. When you enter the restaurant, you will be locked out of all unfinished side jobs and other activities like gigs until you finish until your main jobs are complete. You haven't any Yeah, see? It's a good thing that I did all the side shit first. Cause I'm pretty sure the Witcher 3 did the same thing. So I'm glad I did that. We're gonna. We're, that's it, man. God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. <laughs> porcelain bitch. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong. Suits. What about yours, Unless dude? First sign of trouble. He dealt. Up. Lest we forget what happened to the infamous Johnny Silverhand. Hanako-sama ga omatsuda. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Of course. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. That'd be nice. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now I knew from the start. What? You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul, even slightly interested in the matter, believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Ties that bind. Yes, family. Got it right. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. Mm. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm -hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. Mm. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. Oh, damn. It will bring justice. All right. Did you bring Soul Killer 
As we agreed, you Finger would. on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge. Something got you spooked? I don't know. Three times now that AB has flown by. Think someone might have tailed you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that. Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. We'll see about that. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do. And one is very near. Where? Here in Night City. Beneath Arasaka Tower. Hmm. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. We'll see about that, Sit. Johnny. We'll see. We have little time. I'm... Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother. Uh -huh. You catch a whiff of that? It smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility. <laughs> Fucking Johnny, dude. God damn. <sighs> Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting Aww. of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. Oh, there it is again. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. Okay. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Want me to throw Yorinobu under the bus in front of Arasaka top brass? Sounds a little sus. Uh, Call me crazy, but that sounds like fucking suicide. I will need to return. This I know. And that is why we will take all the necessary precautions. Like, such as? You will see. That that doesn't uh that doesn't help. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arisaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for the Speaking of which, what the, what happened city? to Takamura? Did they actually kill him? Everyone must know their place, V. What that dude was still alive somehow. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. No wish to, or no permission, you being a woman. I decide my own fate, as should you. So... Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally, but think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah. Does it look yeah, like I'm doing well? Done. You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Seems that way. Don't delay. Uh, Make your decision. I'll think it over. You could use some air, right now. Oh, that's what we're doing, Johnny boy. <coughs> oh, great. Whew, man. We're dying over here. I warned you. What? What are you doing? Shit, it be hours from it now, Did you 
can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. What are you trying to see say? What I'm getting at. Yeah, I see what you're getting at. Yeah, I get it. I don't like it one bit. I'm still going Come on, strong. Face the facts. Pop some pseudo endotrizy. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. No, yeah. Johnny, no. How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Rogue, huh? Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you half a century ago, but now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. Mm. We'll blast our way into Socket Tower. Yeah, so like we could, so you could die day. just like last then time. Way inside, nah, place. dude, that 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 does it's not sound. What about Pan Am? Yeah, I'm she going Pan Am, help. dude. Are you kidding me? Listen, I know you and Pan Am got a thing going. I get it. I do. But that's what makes it such a shitty idea. You don't want to rope her into this. Made the same mistake myself once. Mm. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. That's a good point. Our but... one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now and her name is Rogue. he think it could work with her experience her resources her connections won't find anyone better in NC mm. it's gotta work we breach the tower all cracks open Makoshi then I fuck up that oh there we go well it seems like I'm gonna have some decisions to make here we can either go with Hanako Rogan Johnny we can go with Pan or Pan Am and the Aldecaldos. What? Am I? No, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. We have some options here. Easy there. Don't move just. Oh, hey, it's Victor. What's up, man? Vic. I haven't seen this guy in a hot minute. Pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. Oh, feels like. Someone's using your head as a knife block? How. How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Oh, speaking of Misty, I see you're in the back there. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table <laughs> and demanded you be treated immediately. Talonic was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Fucking Johnny. I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. Oh boy. Ah. So slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. There's Misty. Fucking Johnny. Hmm. Something to say, Vic. Just say it. What's going on, man? How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you will be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? 
Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? What are you trying to spell out, it's man? It's in your hands, not mine, oh. and not those of that thing in your head. All right, that's that's what you're trying to say. Okay, now, well, see that set up over said there? that already. Yeah, what about it? You'll find the last dose of pseudo endo in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Is that a little present for me over there too? Are they? Uh, 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 is that what I think it is? Yards to the table. Damn. This will be up to you and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Oh, you're not. Endotrizine, Rogue, Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your, your noodle? noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, it's in, not this in this basement. basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. <laughs> yeah, he is. Out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. I uh, think I can do it. Whatever you decide. Say. Let's make sure to get out of here. Who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh, was it? No, nope. never does. Meaning? It's a rerun. One I'd like to go back to. Uh. Why'd you get so mad then? You already knew who won. Oh no, really. Guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but it feels a little strange to call that a mistake. Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Hi, Vic. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there too. Good luck, kid. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. Hmm. And let me guess. My R is sputtering. <laughs> mm -hmm. Afraid so. Okay. All right, let's go. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Okay. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Jackie, huh? Same glum face. Who, no, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. <laughs> no choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but. 
he found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Does he look like a bitch? See that? Ah, uh, that's more like it. Air. I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. Near on unachievable these days. So what... What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. <laughs> of course. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. For now. You know, you should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. Is that what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do Ooh, it. Oh man, do I have to and make the decision now? To, now's the time. Pills can wait. I'm calling Pan Am. Pan Am. Yes, Johnny Pan Am. I want to hear her voice. Sure as hell hope it's that and only that. Yeah, 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 Johnny, whatever. Mm. Hey. Pan Am, hey. Do you know what time it is? Won't keep you long. Just wanted to hear you. Hmm. He picked an interesting hour for it. <laughs> v? Okay, what's going on? To know that we'll see each other again. What? You know, fine. Fuck no, off. no, not like that. Make up your mind. Pan Am, come on, girl. Something. Listen, please. Something I gotta do today. Gonna be high risk, big time. But I have to. What is it? It's not for comms. Not really. Then shut up and tell me where you are. In the city? Yeah. Okay, then plant your butt somewhere and wait. I'm on my way. You don't get it. I... I can't wait anymore. This has something to do with what you were telling me before? Of course. It has everything to do it with does. that. Well, I'll say one thing. There's always a way out. Here's what you need to do. You need to take a few deep breaths. Then rethink all this. Hard. And then you can call me back. Do you know why? Because I am here for you. But end of discussion. Huh. Well played. Wouldn't let me get a word in edgewise. Probably for the best. Would have said too much anyway. Was good you called. Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just quite the you. quite the way. Yeah, started in a fucking landfill. Mm -hmm. Then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. <laughs> Trying to save your sorry hide now. Fucking Johnny, man. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. All right, Johnny, all right. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Ooh, I think it's time we save the game because... Uh, oh, no, I can't save. It's not letting me save. Oh, God. Oh. I gotta go Pan Am, dude. I gotta go Pan Am. I'm gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. I'm sure, man.
Yes. I'm gonna try this with Pen Am. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. All right, Johnny. My last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh, just want to be there for it. Where? See you inside, Makoshi. All right, Johnny. Johnny. Okay, just me now. All right, that's it. Go time, baby. Ready to talk? Ready. I'm glad to hear that. So tell me. Need a way into Arasaka Tower now. Sorry, what? I'm serious. Whole thing with Johnny. I don't do something soon. I'm done. Gone. Slow down. First. Why Arasaka Tower? The tech. Underneath that tower, they got an access point to... Well... Odd as it sounds... A prison of souls. A prison of souls? Yes, Pan Am. Yeah, this might not fly over the hollow. Mikoshi. That's its name. Only place Johnny and I can disentangle for good. It's my last chance. So, again, just to be clear... You've called me at High Moon to ask me to help you break into Arasaka Tower, or you'll die. About the gist of it, yeah. Basically, yeah. Okay. What? Okay. Where are you? Vic's clinic. The Ripper? Right. I know where it is. Can you hold off on dying for a bit? <laughs> Give it a shot, sure. I'll try, Pan Am. Look, I'll try. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to get you. I'll try not to die, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how long we can make make that whole, you know, hold that off for. Is that you, V? Or yeah, it's me. So what now? Wait for the driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Sounds good. Oh, there's no going back now, man. We we made our decision. To wait, mind if I give you a reading? Sure. sure, why not? See what you have to say. Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil, but that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. <laughs> what a surprise. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The fool. the fool symbolizes the start of a journey, the announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The magician. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction. Mental instability. Okay. Definitely, Johnny. Well then. He is one great disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The lovers. Huh. 
Something that doesn't give me the chills, finally. Pan Am. Friendship, love. Uh huh. V, have you been keeping something from me? Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? You're making a strange face. I, uh. <clears throat> oh, boy, no, that's funny. I'm fine. Okay. And Johnny's? The moon. Well, it doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. Sounds like my driver's here. I think that's for you. Yep. No mistake in that ride ever. You scared me. You There's my ass. girl. Didn't think anything could scare you. <laughs> that's true. Hey. We're here to help, okay? We're. Come on. Everybody's waiting at camp. Oh. Look out for yourself, V. You too, Misty. You too, Misty. And thanks for everything. All right. Guess we're going to the Alcalo camp. <laughs> Welcome back to the living. You feeling okay? Oh shit, here we go. What happened? You passed out on the way. We tried shaking you awake. No avail. Sure does seem like your condition might be getting worse. Uh, yeah. Pan Am asked me to keep an eagle eye on you. Where'd she go? She's off debating Saul. You need help. That's clear. They sat right down to figure out how we might do that. Come on. I'll take you to see him. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I really so, need So, V, I heard talk uh, that there's a war coming. No. I have Cuban I don't got a choice, Mitch. Looks yeah, like we uh -huh. don't have one yes. neither. Look, the, the whole clan right knows there. we set out tomorrow. They know why. What's up, Sam My Elliott? Name is... Look around, V. War tested <coughs> veterans are a fist. Oh, fuck, I'm dying. The rest the mostly raid rinky dig convoys and salvage scrap. So for now, they only know as much as they need to know. The plan is solved. The aim is to help you Do out. Not go muddying the waters. Not now. We're sending this clan to its grave. Fuck, you think I don't know that? And yet you seem to think you can change something by chewing me out like you usually do. Oh boy. V, finally. How's your health? Been better. So, what have you guys patched together? We still have details to iron out. But we know the who, where, and how. Have a look for yourself. A few strategies we sussed out. But only one grants us a decent shot at penetrating Arasaka Tower. We'll dig mm. a tunnel. Sure, these plans are up to date, completely reliable. Positively, we went to our Snake Nation source. Snake They've been Nation. Stones over in that area. I'm not one to lie. This tunnel gambit is risky, but if it works, that's our way into Mikoshi. So you want a tunnel into Arasaka Tower? It'll work. I know how it sounds, but we'd be plum fools not to take advantage. I see Night Corps building a new maglev line in the area. Granted, it's guarded by Militech, but they're nothing we can't handle. Once we're in that tunnel. It's just half a mile to the substratum levels of Arasaka Tower. If you're using one of Night Corp's cirques, you would only need a few minutes to dig that distance. Not bad, wouldn't you say? Once yeah. we're in, we'll have to improvise. Guards, security measures, the fastest way sure. into Koshi. We'll take things as they come and hope for the best. All right. V, any thoughts? What's a cirque? A subterranean extraction and removal combine. It's automated tunnel boring. Okay. If we can grab one, we'll dig through to Arasaka Tower. Then go on to Mikoshi. All right. Construction site. What do we got for security? Whole place spiked? Militech out in full force? It's your average hard hat area. Nothing too scary. But we can't just walk past them. We expect to see the usual. Drone patrols, on-site operators, restricted access. Uh-huh. Plan. Entire op. It's about heading into enemy territory. You'll make enemies of Arasaka and others. So it appears. I'm exposing you, all of you, to danger. Want out, want to cut your losses? I'd understand. No hard feelings. You came to us for help. 
We decided we'd provide it. Our minds are made up. No more discussion needed. It's settled. We had best get to work. All right. I'll talk to our brothers and sisters. Get a drone buzzing over that site. And I'll check with Mitch. I think I know how to even the odds against military. All right. Sounds Come good. Come find us later. I'll leave you in Saul's hands now. Just no making decisions without me. Okay. All right. All right. Is there anything right. else you need? Hey, you and Pan Am. Something I need to know about. It's funny you should ask. I thought we'd smoothed over the rough edges between us. Then you showed up. What? Pan Am thinks so too? You'd have to ask her yourself. CB, you're like the outsider who happens upon a family and witnesses nothing but endless quarrels. Then all of a sudden, mm. the outsider's presence is noticed, and the family members shake hands, join hands, become stronger than they were before. Understand? Yeah. At least I think so. Okay. Good. So now you can tell me what else you need. We need a decent net connection. Someone I know can help us get into Mikoshi. Who might that be? Alt. She's... It's... An AI. From... Uh, past the black wall. Are you fully present up there? Why in hell would an AI help us break into Mikoshi? Because I'll ask it to. Nicely. Fuck me, V. Hey, man. This is all a part of the plan, dude. It's it's gonna be one crazy ass you know plan, what? like it always is Fine. in situations like this. We're up to we gotta do it. Dung. Anyway, might as well go deeper. Find Dakota. She'll get you geared up. No questions asked. Thanks, Saul. So. All right. Thank me once we get out of Mikoshi alive and in one piece. All right. Where's Dakota? Dakota. Where's Dakota? You don't look like Dakota. Why? Everyone got it out for me. I don't know, lady. I have no idea, really. Man. Where can I find Dakota? Mitch is out that way. I, can go, I guess I'll go talk to Mitch first. Long gone and forgotten. You might as well have started with once upon a time. But that's just it. Doesn't matter where we go, we're strangers in our own land. Every state is practically its own country. It wasn't any different back then. Unity is a state of mind, Teddy. An imagined community. Dakota even here? here? Now, you know where you stand. That's Mitch. Look at it this way. Life Bob, the point if you don't Teddy, it's my girl. Maybe that's exactly what freedom is, brother. If that's freedom, Coda's not here. Let me go see if like we can I find her. Like somebody's gripped my throat and won't let go. The fuck are you, Dakota? Oh, she's definitely not here. Dakota, Dakota, where you be? What the hell is she though, like for real? What the hell are you guys doing down here? I want to get myself chipped. Straight to the point. I like it. Might as well, dude. We're on the last. We're, we're getting close to the end here, so we might as well see what else we can get, right? Let's see what else we can get.
community to burn. Alright, Alright, that's fine. Dakota! Not Dakota. Yes? What's up? I wanna see what you got in stock. Only the baddest fire off. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Don't look like you got anything, buddy boy. It's on the other hand. It's K though. Seriously, seriously though, where the hell is Dakota? Do I, should I just go talk to Mitch? I was going to do that in the first. Oh, here she is. This is Dakota right here, right? Oh, it's Carol. God damn it. Who the fuck? Oh, this is Dakota. Jesus. Hey, Dakota. It's been a long while. Dress. What is it you need? Need a strong rig for a little jaunt on the net. Okay, get in. Gonna be hitting a masked, encrypted BBS. Prefer nobody knew I was there. Your tech up to it? Up to it, he asks. Heading for the wild frontier, Dakota. You have all you need to pierce through to the other side. You needn't fear prying eyes. Not at all curious what I'm going in for? You don't ask me. I don't ask you. That is the path to a lasting relationship, brother. Everything is ready. You can go in. All right. Well, thank you. Let's go in. Ice-filled tub. Favorite bit. Always with the ice. Carol, here to help Dakota? Evidently, I'm here to help you today. You good to go? Can't say how long this is gonna take. Whatever happens, stay cool, all right? Even if you look like you're about to flatline? I mean, maybe? All right, time to move. Follow the vectors, brother. All the vectors. All right. Let's, let's. Hello, Alt. You come alone. Johnny's currently indisposed. Currently, he is buried deeper. You treat him like an unwanted passenger. A backseat dreamer of a world not his own. I had no choice. It was the only way I could come here, meet with you. Repression. You are good at this and improving. Repression, huh? Let me get this straight. Mean to say you only agreed to help me because of Johnny. And since he's not here this one time, you're thinking of backing out. I do not aim to back out. I have my own intentions for Mikoshi. Because for a second you were displeased, and I seemed a side note to all this. To observe the two of you interacting, 
informative. Need your help, Walt. Don't go We're running out of time, lady. You truly believe time to be your greatest concern. You exist or you do not exist. Two states of being separated by death. Speak for yourself. Didn't you cheat death? Is this what you believe? Your code, your consciousness. AIs live beyond mm. reality's boundary. They live forever. But we are not immortal. Fair. You will begin to understand, but only in Mikoshi. Why don't you swoop down on your chariot and then light me? <laughs> swoop down in your chariot. AI can handle that. Your logic is flawed. You seek simple answers where there simply are none. This is the very illusion upon which your world is based. Oh boy. At this moment, you would accept any answer if it made you feel better. Hmm. Guess that'd be human of me. Such classifications no longer apply in Mikoshi. Your perception will shatter into billions of strings of unfiltered data. What should I expect there? In Mikoshi. A boundary to cross. In all likelihood, the sole moment of your life when you feel the true weight of your existence. A burden for which you cannot prepare. And Johnny? What happens to him? I lack the data required to answer this question. The data? Is there anything we can know for certain? Yes. That Mikoshi will be no more. Constructs imprisoned there. Gonna set them free? They will be integrated with me. Okay. Constructs will be integrated? I mean you're gonna absorb them. Assimilate. No wonder you jumped at this chance. You wanna destroy Mikoshi. Swallow all the psyches in there. Mikoshi is a prison. Through me, they gain the chance to become part of something greater. Not sure Johnny would like the sound of that. And yet he is absent because you feel you must make the decision. It is the same situation in form. <laughs> Hardly. Doubt you first gab with those constructs, ask them what they think. There would be no point in this. Mm. Wasting time talking. Let's just do this. There. I sent a program to your netrunner shard. Once inside Mikoshi, use it. Okay. It opens a secure connection. Should I look for a specific access point? I can already tell you I saw the way to Tokyo will be back in every single one. Some need but a barely cracked door to enter. Use the shard in Mikoshi. Leave the security to me. Until then. Okay, y'all. Bye bye. Thanks, I guess. We got him back. Carol, the shard! Relax, child. You barely jacked in when your temperature went skyward to almost 100. The tech started acting as if infected. No. Stranger. Spookier. What happened here? You melted half my tech. That's what happened. Neural activity spiked sharply. Your frontal lobe was seconds away from flowing out your ears, babe. I could just as well have popped a bullet in your head. Are you sure you're all right? Sorry about the damage. <sighs> peachy. Good. Real Doing good. real peachy. The shard. Wrote some soft I need to one of the shards. Please. We're surrounded by ice. Even if something punched through, my controllers would have. Holy. Get it away from me. Thanks, Dakota. Don't thank me. All right. Carrie, why the fuck are you texting me, man? I got, I got. This is life and death. Leave me alone, bro. You might as well have started with once upon a time. Just it. Doesn't matter where we go, we're strangers What's in up, our own land. 
Every prep state coming is... along all right? <laughs> you call this prep? I'd call it a damn improvisation. But that's just Can me. Can it, Bobby? Uh. Hey. Right now? Okay. Saul needs me. Come find us after. Will do. Lo and behold, isn't this... In theory, we fitted an afterburner and a multi-RPG launcher oh, there it up is. top. Look at that. We also scooped out about 60% of its total mass. Beautiful, isn't she? You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. All right. Afterburner. Standard nitro or military grade? Standard couldn't move this baby an inch. So hardware's military. But how the hell did you cram all that into a panzer? Oh, small beans compared to the tricks we pulled with Scorpion during the war. Okay. When we unleash this beast tomorrow, you'll see. Since tomorrow's a big day already, how about we take it for a spin now? Want to get a feel for her over the terrain. Sure thing. Maybe after sundown, though. We still have a few loose screws to tighten. That's putting it mildly. Will you quit being such a sourpuss? <laughs> we'll have her ready in time. Firepower up top. What is it? A rapid fire 70 millimeter multiple rocket launcher coupled with an onboard MMI you can sync to via personal link. Nice. Where'd you get all this stuff? Teddy salvaged it from a scrapyard. The launcher itself was fine. The problem was no ammunition. Ah. As luck would have it, Dakota procured some. Don't ask me how. Okay. Well, let's go talk to Saul and Pan Am. Oh, look at this. He got them all... All grouped up over here. Saul, you want an award? Hop up here. What's with the gathering? Something off? It's nothing about the raid. Hop on and you'll find out. Are we going somewhere? All right, V. It's a simple matter. We, all of us standing here, owe you. And it's a great debt. Uh, I don't know, Martian, but we're near the end. We're nearing the end. You're still an outsider. A mercenary from Night City. What might as well be another world. Hey, ask Pan Am. She knows. It's about time we fix it. <laughs> Downright injustice it is. Uh, it needs fixing. You're going to be an Aldecaldo. Which means this family will go to hell and back for you. Ready, kid? Fuck me, Saul. Brought me to the brink of a heart attack. You're your worst. You're one of us now, B. You're an Aldo Caldo, damn it. Hey, Thanks we're an Aldo Caldo. Hey, don't worry. We'll get you into that, Makoshi. Isn't that the Welcome way? Welcome to the family. Oh, shit, look at that. I got me my own jacket. Welcome for our newest Aldo Caldo. Welcome to the clan. The most dysfunctional ever. Jacket's incredible. See? He likes it. Listen, I love me a cool jacket. What can I say? Back from Mikoshi, we'll celebrate. And I know just the place. My treat, of course. We'll hold you to that. Don't worry. It's but a formality. You've been a de facto member of this family for a while now. You saved my rumpus, and as Bobby tells it, Mitch is too. I won't even mention Pan Am. Go to hell. <laughs> Saul's right, though. I mean, let's face it, V. My life was in a million pieces. You broke it into a million more. But sometimes it's only then that you can piece it together again. Huh. All right, All right. ma'am, listen up. Today we celebrate, but tomorrow is shaping up to be a hell of a day. Do whatever needs doing. Do. Then get some rest. A raid is a raid. This is still your night. Some basketball in the you. glory. Could have given me a heads up about this. And ruined all the fun. Oh right, boy, another relic malfunction. Are you alright? Yeah. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. And how's the jacket? Not too tight. Are you alright? Jacket's a distinction. Honor to get it. And it's prima at that. But it's got that weight. Took me under your wing. Give me your trust, and tomorrow, the op I'm taking you on might not come back. Hit me all of a sudden. A second ago. That only proves we're doing the right thing. The sense of responsibility, that's what being part of the family feels like. Thanks, Pan Am. If you want to talk, 
I'll be up there. All right. Well, that's loot, baby. What's this? Yard sale of some sort. This I might have. Take you have to look around. And the so occasion will be. The end time. Oh, the gesture. Dramatic. Actually, pragmatic. I'm giving away my stock to you so you survive tomorrow's mess. Oh. And come back to me. What the hell? What's wrong with this guy, dude? Somebody tell this man to calm down. Then we just have a. Oh, Listen to this. Well, what the count. fuck is wrong with that man? What is wrong with my character, bro? Why am I... Why am I looking like this? What is, what is happening? Why did my character get bugged all of a sudden? What the fuck is going on? This fucking game, dude. Believable. That <laughs> fucking emote, Majin. God damn. Why would I have a, a fucking brain dance equipped as a gadget? That makes zero fucking sense. No goddamn. But simply advance toward their destinations. All right, where's Mitch? Mobility, It's Benedict, right? V. Hey, well, I guess we can talk to everybody before we talk to Mitch. All right? It's going. Yourself? Dakota told me to sit tight for a while longer. Militech's still sniffing. Just have to wait it out. Starting to get itchy hands, though, you know. Best not to fuck with Dakota. That's good advice. And look out for yourself. All right, who else can we talk to? We have a no, no, C major, then G. How are things, Jake? All good? Great, I'd say. The kidney's taken just like a new oil filter. You have my thanks, V. What are you playing? Know this number? Your mouth isn't moving, bro. You're singing, but nothing's happening. And this guy's just sitting there, staring at him. It's a speaker in that new kidney. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. He's got, like, a new cybernetic speaker, like, you know, that allows him to, you know sing or talk or whatever without moving his mouth it's funny Yet. Hey V, got a worn out truth for you. Camps aren't all alike. Feel at home here. I mean like, 
It's possible I'll make this my home. Dakota says I got valuable knowledge, like uh, safe passages south, areas to avoid. I don't know, but feel good. This is, to hear it. What this mission is going to do is make you feel bad when yeah. all these people Hope die tomorrow. Be. Thanks again, V. They're going to kill off everybody, and then they're going to be like, oh, well, uh, don't you feel bad for bringing them all over here? Fire and might. What is this child doing on top of that box? Everything prepped? Head of tomorrow? No worries. Everything's under control. Good. Good night, Saul. Wait. Hmm? I feel I need to make one thing clear. What's that? You've done a lot for this clan. And for me. More than anyone ever has. But the family comes first. Saul. Let me finish. I also know there's just one thing that could break it up at this point. If Pan Am and me... If we went our separate ways, the Alcaldos would not survive that split were it to occur again. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? I wonder if Pan Am feels the same. You all think Pan Am and I are facing off. There's a wall between us. Isn't there. Quite the contrary, V. Pan Am cares about this clan as much as I do. Granted, we don't see all things the same way, but, oddly enough, the family stands to benefit from that. I've seen it. Soon, you will too. I hope so. Take care of us all. Good night. Good night. All right, man. How many more of these nomads am I supposed to be able to talk to? Watch where you are going. That guy's aggressive, dude. I'm just walking around. I had it just a second ago. I swear. You probably just caught CB chatter from some raffin. Militech broadcasts on modular frequencies. Forget it. Trust me. And if I do latch onto their signal. Do you know where I saw the most stars? Mount Sinai, at the peak. Since when were you in Egypt? I used to work on a tanker, so I've been pretty much everywhere. It's important, important that you're good. I'm trying to figure out who the hell else am I, I'm supposed to be able to talk to. Besides Mitch and Pan Am. Salam What? You want a new friend? Huh. I didn't live for life. All right, all right, all right, whatever. We have a safe. Catch you on the trip. We got a problem? Just wait till I'm finished with her. That clunker of yours won't scare anybody. Not even if you spike the rims. I think you swerved a little there. Hmm. Don't you all have somewhere you need to be, huh? Over here, V. Take a seat. Sure. We have this little ritual we engage in. What's this ritual about? Let's see what these guys are all about. Ahead of a raid. Oh, <laughs> that kind. But this isn't your average brew. It's one of the last bottles from our very first run. We kept a few crates, but good luck. What was it someone said then? Shit, can't remember who. Someone said, when we finish them all, the Aldecado's luck will run out. Ah, superstitious bullcrap is your hobby. <laughs> Says the brother whose hand is all shaky when he pops Damn. one Damn. I'll take a swig. 
There we go. Well, well. Not bad. To tomorrow. Goddamn safe returns. To Saul and Pan Am. Because if they don't kiss and make up, everything's liable to go tits up. Bob, you're just always the optimist, ain't you? Fee, you must know where they stand. Do you? You think it's really that bad between them? The truth is, we need cash. And fast. Amen. This Mikoshi's a personal thing to you. But Saul, he sees an opportunity for the hmm. clan. If anyone of the family is still left standing tomorrow. All I will say is, uh, talk to them. They buried the hatchet. Buried the hatchet? Well, I'm really glad they've come to agree on sending us on a suicide mission. Be cool now, Bobby. There's nothing personal, V. I'm just saying how things sure. are. This is all my fault. I'm exposing the entire family to danger. I'm sorry. You've got nothing to be sorry about. The situation is fixing to be a doozy, sure. But if the other caldos are to rise from the ashes, it'll be thanks to you. And thanks to this raid. Huh. For once, I agree hmm. with him. Damn, dude. Do you fellas really think we'll find anything of value there? Seldom happens, but... They both seem Why do I have to choose, bro? I'm going to buy myself a vintage RV. <laughs> Old age is hitting hard, huh? <laughs> Screw you all. I think Pan Am knows exactly what she's doing. But does she know what she wants? Useful if she wants to take the clan wheel. Cool your heels, friend. No one's taking over anything just yet. We need to focus on tomorrow. Yeah, why'd they make me choose there? I feel like. In one piece. Uh, then we talk clan politics. I just. Why not just fucking. Uh, damn it, dude. Can promise why you gotta make them choose, thing. game. All the Caldos will survive. Make sure of it myself. Easy on the promises, V. But you're right. This clan has a chance to rise from the ash. I'm of the same mind. If we come back from Mikoshi. This crazy ass plan works. It'll be a fresh start for the Aldecaldos, I see. Mm -hmm. This feels like the part where Bobby says, if. Hey, now. I'm no defeatist. Don't call me that. All right, guys. All right, best be going. See you tomorrow. Damn, who else haven't I talked to yet? I'm just worried about that wall. How the hell are we going to get over it? Family. Relax. Eat, drink, and be mad. Well. Who are you? I'm just worried about that wall. How the hell are we gonna get over it? Tell me. I was like, you nice uh, want something, Chum? Wish I were on. Who the fuck is Mitch? A matter of fact, where's everybody at? It's all a shit storm anyway. Get a job, why don't you? Like, like, talk to the nomads. Optional. I've been talking to fucking damn near everybody. My daddy has a better job than your dad. The hell else am I supposed to talk to? Hey, friend, you good? I have no reason. What's to up? Live. I already came over here as well. Hola! Yeah, I'm pretty sure I talked to everybody over here already. What you playing at? This is weird, man. Salam alaikum. All right. What the hell is this guy? Oh. Dude. Look what the cat dragged down. Prepping for tomorrow, I see. Aim to prep for tomorrow. You could say that. The trick is to hear silence in your mind at the bank. I 
I heard that a long time ago, round right about when I was your age. I remember it to this day. I'm expecting bangs in good numbers tomorrow. So I'm trying to remind myself of that silence. Mind if I join you? Dad, I even remember what it's like not to hear my mind churning away. If you like. Twelve bottles shattered in 15 seconds. Full focus. That's your only chance of doing it. I'm Twelve and fifteen, okay. Off. Let's find out. Are you that confident? Well, I'll bet my revolver you can't do it. I'll start counting as soon as you step on that line. Begin. do almost kid but practice makes great right. break a leg tomorrow oh I'll break more than that kid all right that was awful I didn't even know like my gun didn't even pop out as soon as the time started counting so that was lame hey I'll go thanks good really good in fact how about you I'm trying to get the Panzer running. She's stubborn, our dame, but I won't give either. So, time for a ride? Sure she's ready? You know me. I'd gladly spend another two days on her, but this will have to do. Hop in. Let's see what she's made of. All right, let's do it. Not to use the missile launcher until the end there, but hey, it worked out. What the hell, dude? I'm here. Let me out. Why is this being like this? I don't know what's going on. Why don't you let me out, game? It, nothing I'm doing is working. I don't understand why. 
Nothing I'm doing is working right now. This is ridiculous. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this game? Drive out a little bit and then drive back over here and see if this works. Oh, come on, dude. You're kidding, right? I'm right here. Why aren't you letting me out? What more do you want? That's you literally that's literally the only thing I can do is return to camp. Why are you not letting me out yet? Oh, I'm gonna reload, dude. This is stupid. This is really stupid right now. The one, th the one and only thing I can do, and it's it doesn't even let me. It's so dumb. I'll take her now. I get picky about parking. That was fucking weird. That was really fucking weird, man. Glad the reload work though. You nervous about tomorrow? It's not a matter of nerves. Not anymore. Don't you want one? Damn, uh, everybody's trying to get me a drink, man. Not? Back during the war, before we were first deployed, we were trained to keep stress in check. Do you want to know how? How? They gave us chem cocktails. Supplements, boosters, God knows what else. They shot them into our veins. Our biomons went wild, but only for a second before stabilizing, and boy, did we stabilize. Hmm. After a dozen sessions, something clicks in your brain. Neural pathways get rewired. The part of you that generates fear is zapped into oblivion. Thought they banned chem cocktails, during the war even. Please. Weren't there outbreaks of cyberpsychosis within units? And? Do you think Militech gave a lick about that? They just airlifted the afflicted to their clinics in Taiwan. <laughs> Daily flights. And every day we'd get fresh recruits. Still they pumped us with that shit. But hey, we couldn't argue with the money. So... Not afraid of anything at this point? If only it was that simple. I'm not concerned about tomorrow. Raids like that are second nature. It's what's going on in the camp. Ah, I see you. Yeah, no matter. I'm talking silly now. Come on. All in family now, isn't it? The truth is I'm concerned about the goings on between Pan Am and That's Saul. how it's been the entire game they with you guys, think man. That putting on a brave face for everyone is enough, but folks here aren't slow. There's gossip spreading like wildfire already. That Saul won't pull through, that he's in it for himself, that this family needs a shakeup. What about you? What about me? What's your take? Saul ought to step down? Pass the torch to Pan Am. We'll see how things look tomorrow. Once the smoke is cleared. Your turn. What do you reckon? Mitch. Not gonna be facing a ragtag band of Raffin or an exposed convoy. If we want to get out of this op alive, they need to have their shit They're together. They're trying. They might even have started to see eye to eye in their own way. Hell, by now, they both know what's expected of them. What the clan expects right. of them. Please tell me Saul offered Pan Am a seat at the table. And what gave you the idea Pan Am wants a seat to begin with? I think I get it. 
Pan Am's about the clan, not power. The question is whether she can reconcile the two. Hey, don't look at me. All right, man. Well. It's like this, see? Pan Am's hell-bent on helping you. But Saul sees this whole thing as yeah, an Yeah, yeah, that's what everybody's Possible been saying. Loot from Makoshi. Mm-hmm. If we pull this off, get our hands on some sweet Arasaka tech that'll set us up down south. Do you follow? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll ease folks' fears. Buy Saul some time. Saul's a smooth operator. He knows what he's doing. Let's just hope he hasn't overplayed his hand. All right. All right, we've gossiped enough I agree. for one day. What was just spoken stays between us, okay? I'm going to poke around some in this baby's insides. Right. Happy hunting, Mitch. All right, see you, dude. Done talking to him. Why is there still an error? Why is there still an exclamation point? All right. I still don't understand why I have this no talk to the nomads thing. Like I thought I talked to everybody already. No, no, I am just fine. Thanks. How many more people do I need to talk to, man? How many more of these people are unique? You're of age now. This was your decision, so you must deal with it. <laughs> you threaten me that you will become a junkie. Just try and you gotta tell me. Who are you? To this guy, that's that's weird. Whatever's going on here. But anyway, what the fuck? What's going on here? And he's all Fire and these fight. all the caldos are freaky, bro. They don't even care, man. They're like, we're all gonna die tomorrow, so we might as well get the, get the going. How are things, Jake? All good? Great, I'd say. The kidney's taken just like a new oil filter. You have my thanks, V. Hey. No any samurai songs. On a night like this, I'm not thinking about anarchy. It's all about unity, brother. You know this number? Didn't we hear this dude sing already? You got an echo, homie. You got an echo. And again, you're not you're not actually talking. You're playing you playing this through some sort of speaker or what? We have a say. Catch you on the turn. Hey, I know you got it. Give me some. That fucking echo, dude. Like, why? Vengeance and the badges slugged out the fire made this spawn a legend. All right, I'm out of here.
My oh my, look at him. So handsome. So it's handsome. Who the hell else do I need to talk to though? I swear I've talked to you damn near everybody. Why why is it still telling me to talk to the nomads? Like I haven't already done that. What do you want? Salam alaikum. I miss my sister. I'm just worried about that wall. How the hell what the hell are you going? sitting on, Carol? We're gonna start worrying about that after tomorrow. But well, once we're down south, you know where we could go? Birdie. This lady's sitting in midair, bro. Beat up old diner down by El Cajon. What are you calling beat up? They have the best spare ribs I ever had. Look at her, dude. That is right. You haven't tasted nothing. <laughs> like a genie. All right, we're, we're going. That's it, dude. We're going to Pan Am. I'm ready. Where's my girl Pan Am at? She's up here. Look at her up here sitting by herself. I, I, I'm, I'm coming, girl. Hold on. So this is where you escape to when you need to think. I never escape. Something's gnawing at you, I can tell. Whatever it is, you can tell me. Nothing's gnawing at me. Stop, this is irksome. Irksome? Pan Come on, Pan Am. Have you... I'm so tense I barely caught a wink last night. It's likely to be the same tonight. What's eating you? Well, let's see. Tomorrow I'll lead my whole clan to near certain uh -huh. death. As if that's not enough, Saul is suddenly concurring with everything I say. And I don't even know if that's good or bad. Fuck. People are doubting us. Well, I talked to everybody and yeah. But they still believe if it all goes to shit, Pan Am will be there for them. Because who else, right? You feel responsible for them. Who in their right mind wouldn't? It's not the responsibility I'm worried about. I'm just looking at this with a cool head. Saul has made all the wrong decisions to be a little more like me. But only I know what I'm good at and at what I stink. I'm not a miracle worker, V. I'm scared to the bone something will go wrong. That everyone will... Be right there with you tomorrow. Whatever happens, we'll be together. We'll manage. I don't know what I would do without you. You do what you needed to. What do you know? <laughs> V? Yeah? Are you not afraid to die? Not as much as I'm afraid for you. Come here. Any for your thoughts? I'm thinking about the first night I spent up here. First night, I've huh? been on the road. I was on my way back and wanted to clear my head before hitting camp. Before another likely shouting match with Saul. It was completely dark. Empty. Not a star in the sky. All I heard was the wind and a few engines in the distance. Huh. And I sat here waiting for the world to fall away. For my mind's RPM to drop to zero. Did it? No. I realized that night it wouldn't happen again. That my mind would always be on the road. Even while I was sitting, freezing on a cliff. I could sit here with you all night. I think I'd like that. Well, let's do that then, shall we? You have no idea how much I needed that. There we go. Sounds like a plan to me. All right, let's go before our asses freeze over. Saul's back. Let's go. Maybe he turned up something new. 